Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're revisiting a game that I've covered, I think like two or three months ago. Hellish Core, which in my opinion is one of the best, uh, if not the best sword fighting game I've found out there. And the reason we're returning to this game is that they just added a new um, game mode and a new character and a boss battle at the end of that game mode. And that game mode is right here, Arcade. Learn the backstories of each fighter in a series of duels that lead to a boss fight. The new character they added is so cool, one of the most versatile characters I've seen. You can pretty much do anything with him as you're going to see in the subsequent battles. And the game mode itself is pretty fun and has like some intricate mechanics like morale and everything that I'll explain in a bit. So boom, we hop into Arcade and this is the new character, Samuel. He's using a saber and he's got like a bunch of movesets that make him versatile and like viable in every single scenario and here we have difficulty uh that it dictates how many opponents we have how much morale we start with and how much morale we have and everything and basically i'm gonna have to win against if i play against skilled opponents which is what i think we're going to play against i'm gonna have to defeat seven opponents i'm gonna have five morale every time i uh, like down someone i get plus one to my morale and every time i lose to someone as in get fatally hit which is easily in this game I lose one morale. When you lose, you can actually retry as long as your morale is above zero. So you want to win as many fights as possible in order to have as many retries as possible. Otherwise, you're going to start all over again. So yeah, let's uh, jump into skilled opponents. Samuel. Before they were taken prisoner, Samuel and Jacob had spread terror in Ruthenia for many re years. Inseparable from childhood, they rented their sabers to anyone who wanted to end the dispute with a neighbor, silence their enemy, or force Bakshish. <laughs> oh, Bakshish! As in, like, lose change or anything. <laughs> Alright. By the way, that's still relatable for me. In my childhood, I also rented, rented my sabers to anyone who paid enough. After they both ended up in slavery on an Ottoman galley, Jakub Zienienski, Samuel's best friend, was released and promised to return uh, with the ransom to buy them both out. A year passed and he never returned. Samuel, with the help of other, uh, the other prisoner, Sava, eventually managed to escape and return to Poland. All he now craves is vengeance on Jakub for his betrayal. But the time spent in slavery allowed Samuel to rethink his past, violent life and perhaps made him a different man. This panel is a placeholder for a cutscene. Again, as far as I know, this game is made by one guy and someone said on a laptop nonetheless. So hey, shout out to you, my guy. And the first fight is against Barbas. In the last video, I said something that people took personally. I, I called Barbas's haircut a yes haircut. Guys, it was just a joke. I didn't intend to insult anyone. Come on. All right, let's get this uh, party started. Now, let me show you why this guy is versatile. First of all, you've got some really good combos. I just started a combo right there, but I didn't even need it. So you can do... There are some cool like combos like this, for example. Like you start with a swing and you can do another one just to be safe you can do this which is a swing into an advanced slash it's pretty risky and then you got low guard the uh, high guard and then you've got like this uh, which is like for stabbing and everything so yeah he's pretty versatile but barbas is very agile oh my god barbas barbas is goated i right, we traded and i lose morale for that so trades which is which are very common in dueling are not good for me because they I'm gonna lose morale and not gain anything from it. Nice stab into a slash. Nice. I drew some blood. Nice. That's a good stab. Nice. Alright, we ended with six morale. Not bad. Oh my god, it's Marie. If you've seen the first video, you would know all about how obnoxious rapiers are in this game. Nice! There we go. That was beautiful. Oh my god, dude. I love this guy's combos. They're just so good. My god. All right, I'm gonna have to try some sort of like sidestep. Just like that. Beautiful. Sidestep into slash. That's how you deal with rapiers. Oh my god, I just lost my hand. Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna try some uh, low guard uh, shenanigans. Nice! It paid off. <laughs> We're stockpiling morale. We're gonna need it. Because the boss battle is pretty hard. You'll see. Nice! Beautiful. Three down, four to go. 
I'm gonna try a leg sweep here. Could be could be useful against this guy. Ah oh my god. Oof. No, come on. All right, I'm not going for low sweeps anymore. I'm not going for sweeps anymore. We're doing this by the book from now on. Let's go for some stabs. I think this guy is vulnerable for stabs. Yep, he is. Let's throw in some high guard stuff. Nice. Wait, I'm the one who got slashed. Oh my God. Come on, man. All right, we have the morale to, to rematch. Let's do it. Ooh, I played him. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's the first time that trick works for me, by the way. The step back into a slash. That's the first time. All right, Isabella, my favorite character, actually. All right, high guard stuff. Come on. Risk it for the biscuit. Got nowhere to run. Come on. Face me. Like, just like that. Just like that. I lost my hand. Low guard OP. Nice. That was a good stab. Last low. Also a really tricky guy to go against. He's freaking out. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> I've been cut. I'm bleeding. Yeah, we're, we're both pretty destroyed. That was a good stab. I right, let's get another one in. Just like that. Here we go. Jakub Sienjenski lied on the ground with Samuel's bled, blade pressed against his throat. But Samuel couldn't do it. After all this, after his betrayal, he couldn't kill his lifelong friend. The time spent in slavery and now confronting all those people to whom he caused so much pain made Samuel realize how much evil he's done. Suddenly, he felt an explosion of pain in his chest. Yasek Dedinsky was standing in front of him with a smoking pistol barrel. Samuel was shot. He fell to the ground and lost consciousness. When he opened his eyes, he was standing in front of himself, looking twisted and evil. It's finally time to fight the devil in me. Yep, the boss battle is yourself. <laughs> I swear, when I first like, uh, realized the twist, I was like, what is this darkest dungeon stuff? Why am I... I am literally facing the demons of my past. But it is such a fun battle. Ooh, look at that. I love this design so much. I love it so much. All right, let me pause just to tell you, Polish bros, if someone can translate what that guy just said, I would really appreciate it. Also, I love the contrast between like the devilish Samuel and the almost Jesus-like Samuel on the left. It's just such a good contrast in character design. Also, uh, I need to beat him three times. He needs to beat me only two times. And the guy is armored. Some of my cuts won't even get him. So yeah, let's get ourselves. <laughs> I couldn't cut through. The armor is in the way. Ooh, that was just a face slash straight up. Oh my god. Ah oh, no. I got the morale to rematch though. We can do this, boys. Come on. No, 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 no. Nice. That was a cut to the, the, to the leg. I just... Ooh, yeah. He's hurt. He's hurt. I gotta keep this advantage, though. Maybe if I go for his leg again. Got him! Let's go! I'm gonna focus his leg. That, that seems to be a good, uh, a good strat. No! He got me. I'm gonna try something here. Oh, no! 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 That was so swift! No! Nah, my god! My god! Yo! Yo, my dude just straight up... Yo, dude styled on me in that one. I'm, I'm kind of... This is getting kind of embarrassing, not gonna lie. Got him. Let's go. No, that was close. That was close. Nice. No. 
<laughs> nice. All right, one more. Just one more. Close. No. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting his timings uh, better, though. Nice. We got him there. Low guard seems to be effective. Ah, uh, until it's not. Come on, step. Do something. No! <laughs> One five morale. It's draining. Nice. All right. If I get it, if I get the timing on that correctly, I can win this. I have to react almost immediately, though. Even then. Oh, no! Even then, it's pretty tricky to measure the distance, you know? You have to be just in the perfect distance to not get slashed, but also have enough of a room to counterattack him. Oh my god. Let's let's try some stabs. All right. That was a good stab. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Stabs are also good. Nice. Right, he's hurt. He's hurt. Nice. Nope. Is that a... Oh, that was a trade. We lose some morale on that, but we're still in the game. Oh, I've got him. I've got him. That's right, boys. Phase two. And here is the coolest part. We only have one shot at this. If I cut him, he dies. If he cuts me, I die. Let's do it. Ooh, he almost got my leg. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. I have to do this again. Come on, man. All right, I'll do it and I'll get back to you, boys. All right, we're back. We're back. We're back for revenge. Come on. Oh my god. Oh, wait. That was the trade. All right, what do we do here? My goodness. I'll be right back. <laughs> we are back again. <laughs> Hello. All right, this is the one. This is the one. No shot. He beats me three times. Oh my god. Oh my god with this guy. I'll be right back again. <laughs> All right, here we go again. Phase one is actually getting easy that I'm farming morale on it. All right, I got him this time. Fourth time is the charm, right? That's the same. Him? Samuel Borovsky trudges through the snow towards the monastery at the top of the mountain. He wears a hooded monk's robe on his shoulders and a cross around his neck, but under the robe, he hides a saber. All right, there we go. Samuel seems to have found redemption, unless I interpreted that uh, incorrectly and he's actually dead or something like that. But he did fight through a lot and face his demons at the end. And that's a message, a positive message for all of us. Face your demons, boys. Awesome addition to an awesome game. I hope that the developer keeps coming out with more characters. And uh, again, the story story uh, mode is coming at some point. But uh, yeah, just small additions like this to keep the people interested and some characters. There is a specific character, actually, that I'm actually really looking forward to. And it's the guy, like the conquistador looking guy. Yeah, this guy. That guy is gonna be cool. This guy too, right here. Look at him. Ooh. <laughs> but yeah, awesome addition. Um, keep keep the characters coming. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. What the fuck? Dude just squared up on me. Whoa, yo, 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 yo. He just pulled out. Yo. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, if you want to see more, just... Show me uh, that you want to see more by uh, leaving a comment and a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Much love. Bye-bye.